Hey, happy Thursday, everybody. Sean coming at you from high level. So this is a huge upgrade actually for the company's module. And I want to talk it, uh, through with you on a couple of levels. So first and foremost, behind the scenes, for those of you who have been following custom objects, this actually represents us transitioning the company object, which used to be itself, self, its own object to custom objects. And the reason we do this is so that we can open up a lot of other opportunities here. And so for those of you who aren't necessarily acquainted with all that, what really all this means is that we're now starting to be able to do some amazing things with the company object as we move towards really uh, up, opening up those B2B use cases. So first up, uh, number one thing here is you can now create, edit, and update custom fields on the company objects. You can obviously manage those fields and you can customize the list view. You get a bunch of advanced filters, advanced sorting options, enhanced search functionality, and an upgraded UX for the company list view. So uh, first up, you can see here on my screen, uh, this is uh, one of the new views here. Uh, and then as we jump through, you can see, you can actually, you can have related objects. Uh, you can do, here's some of the uh, sorting and some of the <clears throat> filtering that you can now do, which is very cool. Um, and then obviously there's this new ad. This is a, just an, a UX UI enhancement to add a new company. And again, here's some of the advanced filtration stuff. Um, you can also manage which fields you're seeing, all this stuff, um, edit which fields are searchable, um, all the new custom fields on the company objects. This is how you, when you actually go in and add a cu uh, custom field, you can now do that, which is very cool. So there's a ton of stuff going on here. Uh, and so um, first up, when you go to the company field, we, we wanna make this optional for people to try out and give us feedback. You can see right here, new company update. You hit try now, enabling new company uh, um, you, experience activates labs for this account. It's a labs feature, but we're giving you a nice little banner here to actually advertise it. Of course, you, as always, you can go into labs, which is under settings in the sub account, settings labs. It exists both, by the way, at the agency level and the sub account level, but obviously because it's a sub account level feature, you'd go to the sub account to turn it on. Um, obviously, we want to enhance flexibility here in managing your business records. Um, a lot of you are doing more uh, B2B selling, and this is really where you want to have focus on having uh, a really good company object. Now, um, what's coming up next? We're going to have uh, workflows for companies specifically, um, and also integration with other modules like deals and opportunities, because that's going to be the next logical step. I'm selling to company A. I have, now I want to deal with them or an opportunity that is represented with them uh, on the opportunities board. And of course, I want to be able to create workflows. So that is uh, coming up next. Huge shout out to the team for making this happen. Now, of course, a massive change like this is going to necessitate a fantastic help document. And we have that. So if you search getting started with companies under help.gohattle.com, you cannot miss it. Um, on that note, I hope you're having an awesome Thursday and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks.